now at noon. Tonight, Coastal NAMI is hosting its very first unmasking of the heroes, excuse me, unmasking the heroes, there we go, of mental health. That's a masquerade ball to honor mental health clinicians and staff. And here to tell us more about it, we have Susanna Yurosky and Mary Crutchfield. And ladies, we're very excited to have you here. Thank, Thank you, you so much for having us. So let's talk about NAMI first. Um, this is the National, let me make sure I get it right, Alliance of Mental Illness. So some people might be familiar with this. We've talked about it here on 13 News Now. But for those that are watching, not really sure what the organization is about, tell us more about NAMI and also why people should support the organization. Yeah. Um, so NAMI is, we at NAMI Coastal Virginia, we're the local affiliate of the national organization. And here we provide free classes, free support groups, mm -hmm. free presentations. And we just, um, the, the classes just provide lots of education, learning how to advocate for our loved ones, um, learning all about the different kind of medications, advocacy. Um, so everything that we do, the, the free classes and support groups, we have some for the loved ones, the family members, and then we also have classes and support groups for those who live with mental health condition. So lots of opportunities to get help, uh, yes. to help people that you love. Of course, it takes funding, and now we have this fundraiser coming up right. uh, tonight. <laughs> so tonight. very exciting this evening. Tell us about the gala, uh, what people can expect that are coming tonight, what people should know. So we are hosting our very first annual gala. It's a masquerade ball. We're going to have about 430 people coming. Mm -hmm. It's going to be beautiful. We have ballroom dancers. We have jazz players. We have a raffle that we're going to do. And we, we sold out. We totally sold yeah. out. So we, no one else will be able to come that isn't yeah. already coming. <laughs> right. So we just want people to arrive on time and arrive early so they, they can enjoy it. And our goal of the gala tonight really is to just recognize all of the people that work tirelessly through COVID in the mental health field, whether it was the professionals or the, the support staff, the providers, and all of our NAMI volunteers and family members that support mental health are coming too. Wow, so this is going to be an opportunity to learn a lot about the organization for those that don't know the tireless work that you do day in and day out as well. And I have to ask, uh, you know, with NAMI, you think about mental health and not just the climate of Hampton Roads, but the climate of the country. Let's talk about how valuable it is to have mental health discussions here in 2023 and, and why it's so important now, uh, important all the time, but especially now with everything that's going on, why we should be normalizing conversations about mental Mental health. Well, that's exactly it, what yeah. you just said, the normalizing of the conversation. And in our t shirts, you know, kind of say it too the mental yeah. health care is health care. It's a part of our health. It's not separate, it, it just needs to be considered just like we do with our physical health. Um, we see the specialist when we break a bone, when we're, right. we're sick. And so when we're sick mentally, we, we go to the professionals and we should be able to talk about that openly, freely with no stigma yeah. attached. Absolutely right. So this gala, the first annual, as you mentioned, happening tonight from 6 to 10. Uh, Mary, give us one more time the details for where people can go to kind of follow y'all and keep up with what you're doing in the future. Sure. So our website is NamiCoastalVA.com, and it is a place where people can go and look where they can join, they can volunteer, they can donate, they can see all of our upcoming events, our family support groups, our individual support groups, and all the legal advocacy work we do, too, just to raise awareness locally locally in our community, that's a great place to go. Or just call our helpline. We have some amazing volunteers that answer it every day. Yeah, there's a lot of people going through a lot right now, and we yeah. just thank you for all the hard work you're doing in the community. Thank right, you for thank having you so us. Much. Thanks I wish you the best us. tonight. Thank awesome. you. We'll be right back.